Nick Markakis. Uh, Nick Markakis has elected to retire after 15 seasons. A lot of talk about this lately, and rightfully so. A lot of guys posted on Instagram. Freddie Freeman had a really nice post. Mike Soroka had a really nice post. And, you know, Brian Snicker spoke about him a good bit. But, you know, this is a guy that broke into the league with the Orioles, and, you know, Baltimore loved him. Uh, I don't know how many of you guys knew that. Baltimore loved Mark Hakus. He then joined the Braves in 2015. And, you know, you guys and I have seen him be just the consummate professional sense. And that's why – that's what Snicker called him anyway. But that's why, you know, I really liked him as a player. Uh, over the past few years, questions arose as to when his role on the Braves would eventually end. And I would say that no one was truly waiting on the day that it would. Uh, I don't think anyone was really hoping that Markakis wouldn't be around. I honestly think that, you know, if they had signed Markakis this year and, you know, that that came out um, – none of you would be upset about it. But like, well, okay, you know, it's nice to have Nick around still. And I think that's the best compliment you can give. You know, he's a he was a good enough hitter to keep on any lineup. Um, I don't think he, he more than likely didn't get an offer, you know, that, that would have fit him. You know, obviously he didn't get one from the Braves. And, you know, I don't, you know, he might have got one from like the Mariners, but who wants to travel all the way to Seattle, for example. But, you know, the guy took payouts to stay with Atlanta. He took pay cuts. And, you know, after opting out last season, he couldn't stay at home away from his teammates, and he opted back in, and boy, was I glad he did. In his final year, he hit one homer. Yes, just one, six, you know, and it was his first game starting after opting back in, and it was a walk-off, the final home run of his career in dramatic fashion. And for a guy who has always stayed a bit under the radar, what a way to finish, you know, and steady presence in the clubhouse, he always demanded respect, not for himself, for others. Uh, we've heard some stories about that this week. If you don't know what I'm talking about, just go look it up. It's a pretty interesting read. But uh, he was a team guy that always shined pretty brightly. 15 years, career 288 batting average, all-star in 2018 with the Braves, three-time gold glove, and he has a silver slugger to his name. And we go into the bottom of the ninth with a tie game, and we all know if you're going up against the Braves and you're in the bottom of the ninth inning with a tie game, it's never good for you. So Nick Markakis would come up and he would hit an inside curveball and take it to deep right field for a walk-off homer in his second game back after opting back into the 2020 season. And I've talked a lot about Markakis over the past week or so. And Markakis, to me, I think is a fundamental part of this ball club. He is the one player who gives you a professional at bat every time he's at the plate. And I know a lot of you are concerned about the strikeouts right now. The Braves lead the majors in strikeouts. It is an obvious concern. With that said, if you feel strongly that Markeka should not have any playing time this season, what say you now?